Hello ladies, gents and avatars of determination, once more I embrace my most daunting task in the history of my Spelunky career. Truly is an unsurmountable mountain that I'll probably never get to the top of. But here I am, having faith anyway. I might have to hire a Sherpa, maybe rent out a helicopter get to the top of this mountain either way it's gonna happen maybe i'll train an ai model to get it done for me by the time i get to the end of this task it'll probably be possible to do such a thing this is a years long endeavor that i'm embarking on basically because i am competing against all these people and i'm just hoping to outlive them is the thing I, if i manage to just try longer than they do eventually i'll be the only one doing the daily challenge of spelunky 2 and that victory will be assured look i have no real hmm this key we'll see there are we'll see what kind of tools that are on offer in the store okay we'll uh, we'll start there we have a uh, magnifying glass. Unfortunately, nothing to actually climb. But that pickaxe is something that can help me out. Unfortunately, it does require a slight persuasion of this shopkeeper to give me what he owns. It's a problem. It's a, it's a real problem. I think I want... Trying to figure out exactly how to do this so I can steal his stuff and also take the Matok. I think we want to kill this guy. I think I embrace that. I embrace death of him, not of me. That would be silly. Uh, that's something that will eventually happen, but not just yet. Not just yet. Huzzah! This is jump plus swing is possible it's possible i know it's possible bud now nah, i made it even harder i think i think you can't do it while running it may be possible that uh you just cannot do it while running we have a giant freaking uh, explosive i don't know what i was hoping there because the moment that that bomb opened the crate if there had been bombs in there well uh I basically was throwing my bombs into the garbage, so... Okay, well, there's nothing to be done here. Oh, okay, the, I was trying to figure out where the hell is the first damn... Oh, Jedi! Right over there, right over there, so we can grab the key, get it to the corner. I think my speakers are way too low right now. Bang ding ow! Yeah, turn out the volume, turn out the volume a little bit. Because I, um, man, I just didn't do it at all. There you go. Now I can hear the damn video game. It's coming here. Don't worry. There will be any echo whatsoever. There will be no interference with what we're trying to accomplish. Uh, okay. This cat will not die. It will just simply go through the exit. I am wondering, do I want the shotgun? Do I want the matok? For now, we'll not make the decision just yet. We're right there. Get our key in the hole. And we'll make the decision at a later date. The later date is now. Do I want to matok? Do I want to shotgun? I think the decision is clear, right? We want to murder everything in our path. So uh, I kind of need it. Wow, what a, what a death trap to be made by this turkey just... Wanton, gratuitous cruelty. Basically telling me this is what is in store for you, buddy. Get wrecked. Soon. Uh, Alright. Get over here. Get real close to Yang. Shoot him straight in the mouth. Feels great. Never gets old. To put this shotgun in his mouth and pull the trigger. Man, what a beautiful get right there and look at this absolute buffoon 
selling a boomerang. We have zero mercy for anybody. I don't care that he's the community's darling. Every bit of hostile energy gets destroyed in my presence. There's no way around it. So, I don't want to piss off every single shopkeeper in my path. I think that is folly. Even though they do have coins in their pockets that I would like to help myself to. We're going to be much more good once more. Adjusting the freaking volume of my speakers. I'm being terribly stupid. Uh, here's what I want to do. A bomb right there. Perfection. Now, please, sir or madam, you, we don't know what's under his skirts. Jump onto the spikes. I appreciate you. I'm very happy <laughs> that you have committed suicide. What do you have? You have things I want. You have things I want. Check me out. Don't worry. He'll go straight into the spikes. He's like, we need to use a rope to get out of here. <laughs> oh, we cannot stay close. For the ghost jar is right there. Please don't kill me. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ah, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, it's not over. It's not over yet. Okay, okay, all right. Just stay there. Stay there, you son of a bitch. Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> ah, did not panic in the slightest. Everything went according to plan. Well done. Pat in the back for that incredible sequence of events. Very, very good. And now we have only 30 seconds. I really want to go back to... Ca Never mind, let's just leave. <laughs> I wanted to go back to Callie's altar, but she's at the very top, and I'm at the very bottom, and she is too busy pegging me right now, so I'm gonna pass on worshipping her mighty, mighty bottle. Let me just move on with life. Oh, I wanted to eliminate the creature. Not the bomb. Thankfully, we have plenty of bombs to go around. Maybe it's time to let go of this power pack. It is just not very conducive to survival. But I do enjoy just having it. Don't worry. It will not be set ablaze in Volcana. We are not concerned. Everything will be fine. Okay, this feller to depart depart my presence give me the cash and uh, we leave great stuff we'll be forgiven next levels unless something terrible happens all right uh i don't know if your guys are aware that enemies certain type of enemies can reflect the bullets so let's not have that happen again that would be terrible so every time I shoot into the unknown, I need to get away from the line of fire. Because on the very other end, there can be a robot ready to absolutely destroy me. We let this out. Ooh, wow, I was waiting it out. These damn dogs, they just... They turn on the dime. Impressive. Okay, that's fine. Uh, no, no, we don't have a skeleton key. There is a crazy weirdo over here. If we trigger the trap and he kills him, that actually counts as our bad, which is total bullshit, but it is the way it works. Okay, look this way. There you go. Get wrecked, you idiot. Hey, just vanished. It, it got obliterated completely. I think uh, there's no reason to go down there. So uh, I'm just trying to work around... A way not to kill this guy by triggering the trap. I don't want to use a rope. Let's just wait until he's just not there. Question. If you trigger the trap and that blows up. Did I technically kill this guy? Or was it just... Was it just the robot? I guess we're going to find out. If I get forgiven right now. It was the robot. The indirect trigger. I'll be I'll be impressed with Spelunky 2's coding. If 
that counted as me triggering the robot, which counts as me murdering the shopkeeper. Uh, I will be impressed, but also not surprised if we are not forgiven right now. We're not forgiven right now. It, it literally counted. Me <laughs> triggering the chain of events actually translated in shopkeeper murder. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that nuts? That was impressive, Derek. Well done. <laughs> I just wanted to hold on to his ledge for no reason. Oh, jeez. Just completely gratuitous. Idiotic heart attacks, man. <laughs> what is happening today? There's no reason for the heart rate to go this high this early in the day. Absolutely idiotic. No! <sighs> I think it's time. We start to get let go of this death trap that I have strapped to my back. Uh, after, we'll do that after we make a giant tunnel. Because you see what is good? You see what, what this backpack is good for? Careful, careful. What this backpack is good for is making your own way down to Vlad's castle. Trying to see if the other corner is better. Okay, that looks semi-safe. Eh, not quite. I mean, we could start up here, and then there's a ton of powder cakes up there. Yeah, I convinced myself, I think. I convinced myself. What a nightmare here. Please give me a rope so I can get the hell out of here and not be disturbed by gigantic firemen. Okay, and now the party begins. Uh, this is a bad spot. It may blow. So, you know, it was a good policy not to get anywhere close. Yeah, I thought the powder kegs would go further than that. That is pretty worthless, but still not regretting in the slightest. Uh, it is pointing at the other exit being that way, which probably means Vlad Castle is not on this side. God damn it. I was also hoping, you know, to go down the path that finds Vlad's castle immediately. No such luck. Okay, so this is a, a bit of a nightmare. <sighs> Fine, I embrace violence. Please, no fireman jumping at me. That would be terrible. We're not. We're gonna try not to kill him. He's dead. He's not dead. He's just jumping around. Come on, man. I have 15 seconds. Die, 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 die. I'm out of patience. You're still alive. Why are you like this? Why are you like this? Not even your mother loved you. Oh, made it. <laughs> Why is this daily challenge so full of barely there saves? This is just silly. I hate everything around it. <laughs> Why am I here? Why are we still here just to suffer? Just get out of my way, you idiots. Actually, let me use your body to trigger a road trap. Open that up. Uh, that is triggered. Indeed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. We did not save Vlad, unfortunately. But check out this drive. Goof! Alright, great stuff. <laughs> Always fills me with joy when Vlad just stops existing. As a result of a violent explosion. As opposed to all the peaceful explosions. That I often partake in. All right, so we still only have one minute, and there is a maniac at the exit. I don't know if you remember, there is an absolute psycho on the other side of this door. Yep, yep, sure is. Not really way around it, just shoot him in the face <laughs> and uh, deal with the consequences later. Here's the thing, there hasn't been that many shopkeepers. Oh, wow, this is a nightmare. Okay, good, good, good stuff. There hasn't been that many shopkeepers in my path. So, hopefully... Oh, he can actually get here. Eh, it's, it's unlikely to get here. Mm, hopefully, there will be no giant piles of shopkeepers lining up for my scalp. 
hopefully we will make this work. Terrible chill runs up my spine, truly. Oh, really? Is that is that the truth, sir? That is so wonderful. I am so happy that that's a thing that's happening right now. <sighs> what do you want me to do, brother? What do you want me to do? The deck was stacked against me from the start. I refuse to take a single iota of responsibility. The the, the flowchart of decisions was made out for me, and I was pushed down the path. I refuse to believe any of these people made any real choices either. It was all predestined, and tomorrow I will face my fate once more. <laughs>